We begin with a major break in the murder of a Schaumburg woman found strangled in her apartment. Good evening. I'm Rob Johnson. And I'm Erica Sargent. Tonight we've learned a suspect is in custody. CBS Tuesday and Kosloff has been following the case from the beginning. She's live in the newsroom with breaking details. Dana. Rob and Erica, police say they followed more than 100 leads, talked to dozens of residents in that area, and had a lot of forensic evidence to help them find Tiffany Thrasher's alleged killer. The arrest comes three days after the 33-year-old was found strangled in her Schaumburg apartment. Police believe her killer entered and exited her first-floor apartment through this window, later removed, likely to test for fingerprints. It was later determined Thrasher had also been sexually assaulted. Police issued a community alert yesterday, which further alarmed residents in the area. Tonight, they and Thrasher's family hope police have indeed caught her killer. Now, sources say police are still trying to confirm if the suspect and Thrasher knew each other. She lived with her niece, who police say was out of town over the weekend. A news conference is scheduled for 10 a.m. Tomorrow. In the newsroom, Dana Kozlov, CBS 2 News. Robin Erica. Okay, Dana, thank you.